to another one of our Christmas videos for 2023 and in this video we're gonna dart around London and show you places that we haven't shown you before and some of the amazing things that you probably don't want to miss out on if you're coming down to London for the festive period. Now we're going to kick off this video with this amazing place. Now we have shown you this video before of the Burlington Arcade but not for Christmas 2023 and as you can see they've really gone for it. They've got loads and loads of wreaths hanging up and loads of Christmas trees as well on the floor, all well decorated, as well as the garland up above. So the Burlington Arcade is one of those lovely places that you want to come and walk through slowly. So if you're not sure where the Burlington Arcade is, it runs from Piccadilly, almost outside the front of Fortnum and Mason, right through to round the back of the Royal Academy of Arts over in Mayfair. And it runs parallel with Old Bond Street. So it's one of those areas where you just want to come and enjoy it anyway. And yes, that's a shoe shine there who's resident. But also when you do come down, you want to have a good stroll and have a good look in the shop. Shops. Yes, it's one of those places definitely to come window shopping and think, wow, how do other people live? Now, outside Battersea, they've got this, which is Glide. And there's the big Christmas tree, which we featured before on one of our Christmas tree videos. And this is a big Christmas tree, as sponsored by Joe Malone, right in the middle of the ice skating rink. So at Battersea, they've not just got one Christmas tree, they've got two at either end of the Battersea Power Station building itself. We've also got this, this gingerbread house, which has been put up by Joe Malone. So I guess if you're going to sponsor the ice skating rink and help make it all happen here, then you're going to do something pretty special. So they put up this gingerbread house. And this gingerbread house is something slightly different because you can walk into this part here, go through, and it's an interactive area. Now, so just to show you some of the things they got on the outside, just to make it look like a gingerbread house, it's lovely. But then when you go in, you can become a gingerbread man yourself. There you go. So it's all interactive. So it's certainly something if you're coming down here, you want to either book in advance or alternatively join the queue so you can come and have a go. Now, it is a very small area, but as you can see, you've got the chance to do all sorts of different interactive things, including appearing with your own gingerbread man and come and sit in the corner. Oh, by the way, there is a beautiful gingerbread smell around the place as well. So well done, Joe Malone. Not only they sponsored it and made it look lovely, but actually that gingerbread house and the interactive part is just a little something extra as well. Oh, and by the way, they've got a Joe Malone shop just at the other end of the gingerbread house, but it's very small. So if you fancy something, that's it. You just pop in there and you can get your Joe Malone gifts for Christmas. By the way, no, no sponsorship at all, but I thought I'd better mention it because actually they have made to put all this together. But this does look rather good, especially with the trees as well. Featured Covent Garden before in one of our videos, right near the beginning, when Covent Garden first switched on its lights. But we wanted to come back and take in the snow. Yes, so every hour on the hour, each day up until Christmas Day, they have snow coming through. And um, we just happened to be at Covent Garden at one time when the snow was blasting out. So if you fancy coming to take part in that and get your pictures, then please do. There you go. I just wanted to show a person in front. Yes, it's foam. Um, but how effective does that look? Snowing in Covent Garden in the middle of the day. Yep, that's the closest we've got to snow so far in London. 
Our next place is over in the City of London and it's Leadenhall Market. Once again, a place that we've featured before in previous videos, but certainly not Christmas 2023. And this year, they've decided to put this light tunnel in. And, well, if you've seen Kenwood and you've also seen Kew Gardens with me, you know how much I love to go on about walking through a lovely light tunnel. So, when they've just left a light tunnel here for me to play, I was in it for almost hours. Well, couldn't have been hours because they probably switched it off and got fed up with me. But just look at the different lights you've got here and also the different colours as well. Fantastic. So this is the front of Leadenhall Market if you fancy coming out and play there. So not only have you got all the different colours it does as well, but also it goes multicoloured. So you've got all the different colours of the rainbow as well. It's lovely.